You already know when you hear that bell what time it is, man. It's after party show. It's your man Fatal, the host with the absolute most. We got DJ Yella here kicking it with me. What's up, Yella? Just kicking it. We're just, chilling with the crew. Yeah, chilling with the crew. <laughs> chilling with the crew. You know what? This it is do. how I was kind of in the studio in them days. It really? wasn't a very many people in the studio, mm-hmm. but just as cool vibe. the vibe how it was. I'm glad you feel welcome here because you very much so are, bro. Everyone here is a fan of what you guys did for the culture, man, with music. And we're talking off air. You guys are very responsible for the open speech vulgarity and hip hop. <laughs> we it was a lot of flashiness back then, man. I'm a, I definitely love hip hop, man. It was a lot of flash back then before you guys came in. And you guys just came in like f the police. I, I my bad. Fuck the police. <laughs> Cheeto said I can cut. Fuck the police. Put another beat. Fuck the police. <laughs> Um, and then that's what got the FBI out for you, you know, because you yeah. guys are creating that barrier of free speech and oh, what yeah. really is allowed and what is not tolerated. Because yeah. think about it, even all our raps, all we talked about is when we open our door, that's what we see, that's what we talk about. We didn't talk about Disneyland, the White House, and all this other political stuff. We talked about the streets. And them streets are everywhere around the world. It ain't just Compton. East LA is all over. Mm. Watts, you know. New York, Brooklyn, all the Queens, all of them got ghettos. But mm-hmm. that's what we talked about. That's why people, I think, could relate to our music because it was a part of them. You know, it's not talking about, oh, over here, you know, Run DMC used to talk about this and they talk about this, you know, but we just talked about what we knew. Mm-hmm. And that was them streets. But you love Run DMC's music, huh? You oh, got, yeah. you got some, I can Run t- DMC, you got some Grandmaster Flat. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. That's my, I ain't gonna lie. That started it. That might, that might be one of my favorite groups, I ain't gonna lie. Run, really? DM, Run DMC, for yeah. sure, bro. Oh, yeah. Come on, Rev man. Run, man. <laughs> man, come on, man. It's tricky, bro. I could bust the whole song right oh, yeah. now, man. But um, what do you think about the transition from all that with the free speech to these new artists right now, these current artists? You you like any of this new music out right now? Like um, what they call mumble rap era or like I, this I, little I, baby, I, the baby? You like all that? I don't listen to it. It's, no, no. It's, not for you? Not for me. Okay. My son or something, but. It's nothing wrong with it. It's just the problem is, it's too many artists. Back then, you hear a song, you know who the group was. Nowadays, 90 people saying the same thing, saying the same, you know. With the same cadence and the same beat. It's like it was one producer, yeah, and, you yeah. know, one little talk box or whatever they're yeah, using yeah. on the voice. You know, mm-hmm. it's it's because it's so accessible. Just like you sitting there with this little machine. Mm-hmm. They didn't have all that. Oh, you had nah, to go man. to the big studios oh, yeah. and somebody had, had to have some money. For real. <laughs> but, you know, music, I guess, is still here. Hip-hop is still here. Now, people don't realize this. Hip-hop is everywhere. It wasn't supposed to last, but it's in all music. Country, rock, heavy metal, all kind of stuff. But hip-hop is here to stay and it's going to be here. But hopefully some of that old school can come back. I hope so too, man. Because I think a lot of it's being reintroduced to the new listeners, yeah. whether sampling or remaking or reusing yeah. an old like melody or something. Oh yeah. So, are there any artists right now that you want to work with? None. I'm There's done none. with music. You're, I'm, you're I'm, done. You're, I'm you're done. Meant, you meant it, bro. You're yeah. an author now. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you went. You went from a a, 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 a founding DJ to a, a, a director NWA to, a, to a porn director <laughs> to a author. Now, bro. Arthur, wow. What's going on? What's next? What's the next endeavor, Yella? You know something? What's next? You may bro? not believe what I'm going to say. Let's, let's hear this. He man. may not believe what I'm going to say. Oh, let's hear this next one. I'm going to be a preacher. Hey, bro! If Mace <laughs> can do it, bro, but why can't? But DJ I'm Yella, doing it. Dog? I'm Come doing on. it for real. You're not, you're not gonna do what Mace did. I'm in it for. The you know, real. Mason Betha, man, he went out there, he left, welcome back, he came back, welcome back with the Carter sample, and he was all like on some like I'm pr- I'm a safe man. This bad boy's gone clean. And now he went back. And then he went back to being ratchet again after that. See, so I, I, I'm that's in what this. What people? You got just like, like just like the porn. Yeah, I was in it 100. percent Okay, with NW, the hands and all. In, 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 with the famous hand, <laughs> the right hand too. <laughs> Thanks for the clarification. Yeah. <laughs> NWA 100. percent Everything I do, you do it all the way. It's 100. percent The women 100. percent So this is my calling. I don't want to be, but that's what I'm going to be. So. What what inspired that man? Was there was there something huge that happened in your life that made you go? You know no, what? Like no, I never I, I never was looking for God. Never wanted he came him to you. Never he came to me. Even me, the worst sin in the world, <laughs> seemed like it. He came and got me. And okay, this is it. I'm going forward. I ain't looking back. I ain't gonna do like this Hollywood save people. Nah, I'm in it for real. I'm in it for real. 
So you might be in front of some youth groups or something like that. Oh, yeah. Soon. I spoke already at the little juvenile halls and stuff like That's that. That's awesome, bro. Oh, yeah. I mean. You enjoy that. It does yeah. something for your soul. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, trying to, just like the book, it got stuff telling these new rappers and these artists about lawyers, about paperwork, about artists, about producer fees, about this, that, you know, trying to teach the dumb stuff we did back then, mm-hmm. you know, because we didn't have nobody. We couldn't go on Google, to get educated YouTube, on it, and go to the university for three weeks and graduate. We didn't have all that. We had to do everything raw, mm-hmm. even the music, everything. And the women. And the women, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I, I got you on that one. <laughs> Come on, y'all. I was ready, dog. Give me some props. I was ready on that one, dog. Come on. <laughs> so this is actually very interesting to me, man. So this, this show is evolution. This show is growth. And now... That's actually very interesting to hear that you want to do that, man. Yeah. That's inspiration for people tuning in. Know that you don't have to, you don't always have to end in the lane or the direction that you started. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I've never too late. Looking this It's way. never too late. Yeah. Never. As long as you got long breath in you, your lungs, you can do I it. I was about to say that. As long as you Come can on. breathe, you got a chance. But once you get that last breath, there's no chance. Word. And can't nobody save you. You only can save yourself. That's facts. <laughs> That's facts. Yeah, I appreciate you, brother. Real talk. Thanks for coming by the show, man. Before we get out of here, I always let everyone speak some positivity before they leave. Speak some inspirational that you want to um, give as a demonstration of what you've been through to get here to people tuning in. What would that be, man? Just if you're doing music or stuff, do what you like. That's what we did. We didn't make the music for them to like it or them. We did it. This is how we did it. You either like it or you don't like it. Well, fuck you. <laughs> I mean, that's what it is. Yeah. That's what you, that's your guys' attitude. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Get down or lay down. Yeah. And me, my thing now is I keep God first. Even over the kids, over my wife, they know that. They're second. He have to be first. You know something else? When I was homeless for three and a half years, I never stressed. Okay, I'm just homeless. You know, it's my fault. There ain't nobody else. But I never stress. But now I know you keep him first. If you keep God first, you won't stress about nothing. It's like this. A bill come. You either got the money or you don't. What's stress going to do? Make something happen? Nah. Because stress kills. A lot of people die. Stress causes cancer, they hate saying. Yeah. All kind of strokes, heart attacks, all that. So I just stay positive. Never negative. Word. I feel that. Except, except COVID negative. We're COVID negative, yeah. right? <laughs> yeah. Okay, I'm just making sure up in here, man. I appreciate you, DJ Yella. <laughs> Hope you had a good time with us, man. Oh, yeah. Everyone go out here and get this book right now. It's available right now to the world straight it's out of on Compton. Amazon. Straight My own told yeah. story. On DJ Amazon. Yella. Check it out. And they can get it on Amazon anywhere else? Yeah, Amazon is the place. Because i seen that you were, are you still oh, doing the signatures? The signatures and- come from my uh, private website. It's djyellaofnwa.com. Okay. You get the autograph one. I'm gonna have to get a couple for the crew. I think. Uh, yeah, I got you, some. You, I got a trunk load. Yeah. Okay, I think. I think. Yeah, Cheetos. You oh, want yeah. one? Oh yeah, Cheetos. You See, that's it? what you call support. Yes, that's what we got to do. I mean, think. And I'm gonna tell you something else. Music is the only thing I know of that has no color. No, we're talking. It breaks racial barriers. Everything. I don't care if it's country, pop, metal, rap. It doesn't matter. It's, it's supposed to be no color. But that's how the world should be. But. You know how the world. We is. need some more colorblind out here. People yeah. are too look at the f- yeah. focus on the on the the color man of who we are. We're all humans. We bleed the same blood. Yeah. It's all red. It's blue wallets in our veins. Yeah. We all we the die. same. You we feel all that skin the off. Air. We all the same. Real talk, man. I appreciate <laughs> you, Yella, for the knowledge, the gems, the jewels. Follow. Where can they follow you one more time? If they're not already doing so. Uh, Facebook is DJ Yella of NWA. Instagram, and check out the book. Straight out of Compton, my untold stories on Amazon or at my website, djyellaofnwa.com. All right, baby, we'll be right back. DJ Yella, NWA in the building. It's after party. After the show, it's the after party. Yeah. More music, let's go. Woo!